Hello everyone, it's your favourite queen, Android18 here, and I'm back with another Dragon Ball discussion. This is kind of like a theory I've made up, and I don't know if you guys will like it, but I think it's interesting, and it might actually be kind of a answer to why the Great Saiyan Man is a thing. So yeah, anyway, the topic of the video is, why did Gohan, like, when he's the Great Saiyan Man, do poses and because some people think it's goofy and if you aren't aware um essentially go the great saiyan man's a parody of like kind of japanese superheroes like power rangers i believe so that's why he's quite comedic and he's kind of over the top but it's funny but if you actually notice gohan does like poses and speeches and tries to be really cool when he is the great saiyan man and some people think it's lame, and other people think it's cool, so it's a bit polarizing, but the thing is, I've been thinking that when you actually look at Gohan do poses and stuff, it actually is very similar to the way the Ginyu Force did poses. And if you remember, Gohan was on Namek, and he fought the Ginyu Force, obviously, and he was a witness to their kind of strange poses and, you know, the pose of joy. <laughs> you know what Ginyu says. He, he never gets to do it, but basically all the Ginyu Force members have poses, which you probably know. And I was thinking that maybe Gohan does like poses and speeches as the great Saiyan man, because when he was a kid, he was like exposed to the Ginyu Force. And for some reason he thought that was cool, even though he got his neck stabbed by Raccoon. <laughs> Sorry, I had to bring that up. That's kind of brutal, but it's kind of funny in this context. But what do you guys think about that? I think I actually personally think that um, Gohan does that and he got inspiration from the Ginyu Force, but I don't think he really realized it. He just kind of thought it was a cool thing to do because he saw it when he was a kid and he might have thought it was cool. But yeah, I think it's interesting. And also, the Ginyu Force normally, like, state what they're good at. For example, Berta is apparently the fastest in the universe. And, you know, <laughs> I think it's kind of an interesting little theory I thought about. And, and I also want to know what you guys think, because I think it's a pretty good theory, actually. And it kind of makes a lot of sense as to when Gohan wanted to, you know, be a superhero and save people from, like, bad people, I guess. It would explain why he does poses and speeches, and I, I actually really like The Great Saiyan Man personally, so it's cool. However, I know some people don't, and this is kind of my head canon of kind of trying to explain it about why Gohan does this. So yeah, what do you guys think? I actually think it makes a lot of sense because Gohan obviously wanted to become a superhero and wear a mask, so when he goes to school, they wouldn't know it was him, obviously. Unlike Videl, where she just goes out and beats all of them up, and she's loved for it. However, Gohan's quite a shy person, so he doesn't like to, you know, be known as a powerful superhero, or the golden fighter, as Videl would call him. So, yeah, I just think it makes a lot of sense, and what do you guys think? Anyway, hit the like button if you enjoyed this quick little discussion. Make sure to hit the bell and subscribe to get notifications for whenever I upload a video. Or do that the other way around, subscribe and hit the bell. There's a link to my Discord and my Patreon in the description of this video. And yeah, I hope you have a lovely day. And also, don't forget everyone, subscribe to me because I'm definitely 18.